No, and she, she said that in her interview afterwards that she knew she didn't have it. And so to grind out around the golf knowing that is, it can feel like it's a long day on the golf course. She was up and out of some putts. moving it's moving too much good read there Karen so just gonna be a three for Nelly she will remain 17 under par a couple of shots ahead cup show stays 15 under oh for Nelly she had the lead at the halfway stage in 2021 by three shots and then Nelly kind of took over heading into the final day you definitely kind of see that around this golf course, though, Tom. Look at the top. To lie here. Just seeing how it's so hard to generate any spin from the thick rough. Oh, she's going to use the backstop. Yeah, that'll come down a little bit. Oh, Nelly's got to kind of shape up a little bit here, there and she does go. that. Well done. Okay. Yeah, Lexi Thompson at seven a moment ago. Knocking it in there tight, so that should be a birdie. Fabulous putt from over the back of the green. So Lexi makes the birdie at seven. And this is a really difficult putt. It's going to be uphill, it's going to break to the right, and then it's going to go downhill towards the hole. Nothing easy in this. Wow, and what that's pace. Uh-oh. Wow. Quick stroke. Yeah, it looked like the putter maybe went a little bit inside going back, tugged it just a touch. I think it's interesting, Karen, there. We saw a little bit of frustration from Jennifer. I feel like she controlled her emotions pretty well yesterday, but that was the first sign of kind of real frustration. I think this is a must make for her confidence right here. Well, and, and for, the, for the emotional side of things, too, given the frustration that we saw of the tee, so all right. Might be just enough to settle her down. One of the quickest players out here on the LPGA Tour. And she'll want the pace of play to move along nicely today. If she's not the fastest, then Brooke missed the cut. At the 10th, oh, Leona yeah. McGuire. Here comes Leona again. Took Nelly down to the wire last year. That eighth begins that run of par fives here the last 11 holes and here's another one third shot for Titicun. and a tap in for her it's important for her I think here to hit a good drive in the fairway see something positive happening let's put two good swings together and this is a little bit out to the right though should catch the green should have Cannot be thinking it's just you two on the golf course. Oh, oh, did she do it? Oh, oh yes! Drips it in. Well, that is a good way to jumpstart the round right there. What a putt. Kind of the distance we've seen her struggle with just a bit the last two weeks, spending a little more time over the ball. That looked a little bit more reactive. Like she pulled the trigger a touch faster there. Cupcho trying to reel one in here too. Second shot. Well, I can see her doing it too. It's just an eight on. And this is uh, drawing towards the oh. hole, clicking for it to stop. Mm, it's going to, I think. Yeah. Mm. So maybe Eagle Birdie to finish the front nine. It's something that she's going to thrive on. Did she make it? Oh, Nelly standing yeah. in the wrong spot. Yeah. <laughs> Good birdie for Capcho. What a run to finish for that front nine. Remember, it was at this 12th yesterday where Lexi got up and down from this rough behind the green, and it really seemed to give her some momentum. Leona. Nelly found the bunker. This is her third shot. Well, those 45-yard bunker shots are not much fun for anybody. Yeah. Trying to get that to release some. So Nelly's going to have to make that to avoid. She didn't hit it. She didn't hit mm. it. Foot short. 
What a change of momentum. We've seen Kupcho be down, pick herself up. We've seen Nelly be up, and now she's gone down. And Karen, Nelly needs to start hitting some fairways to make it a little easier on herself. She's having to work way too hard around this golf course so far. Yeah. Saw that reaction. She's had about enough of the front nine. Lexi tied for the lead. Third at 10. And a slight downslope with the wedge. Oh, yeah. And Lexi Thompson going to have that putt to take the outright lead. Since her last victory, seven second place finishes. This at 10 for the outright lead. Yeah, this is one of the holes that Morgan was talking about to move the tee back, as we said, and that's a really good birdie for Leona Maguire. Jennifer's got 122. She's got a wedge out. Ball is a bit below her feet. Wind is into and off the left. Someone's drifting a little right of it. Just barely. Mm -hmm. Suddenly now, Cup Cho for the lead. Well, coming off a couple of really good putts already. Previous two holes, and that was just awkward side of the hole to putt from there. Difficult read. Well, is this any good? This is Cup Joe, second at 11. Balls above her feet, landing it exactly halfway between herself and the hole. That was How good. good was that for touch? Yeah, it's really good. Yeah, got three. Done. yeah the tournament has uh, priced. Fall back into a share of the lead. Lexi second at 12. I'd say that's a pretty good bounce back. Is she throwing darts with her wedges? Wow. She really played brilliantly all week, and Minji was just too good. But some missed opportunities for Lexi. A three putt at 11, a short birdie miss at 12. Really cleaned up her stroke. That was a gorgeous one right there. Oh, it didn't break. It's exactly where she aimed it. Back of that green almost kind of falls a little bit away, and it's tough to read. Okay. That they can find that little bit of difference and straighten it out. This to make it a four way tie at the top. Leona for birdie at 14. Oh, yes. She said last year right here, battling Nelly told her. Great line to that flag from here. Really play up the green. Oh, yes. Oh! Now she missed six of the first seven fairways. Pummeled one. Dead straight at ten. Made birdie. Nelly to answer. Yeah, there you go. Right. Okay. And Nelly's up to the challenge. Uh, knowing that when that happens, she was going to have to lean on this place too much. Green's died now. This one's still on that to the right. Kind of get the feeling that you really want to keep pace right now. Great match play player. Oh, there you go. And she curls it in in front of Nelly. Just staggering. 15. After the birdie on the par five, this is Jessica for a two. And that looks good. It drops in the side jaw, <laughs> just like Cup Joe's did. Par five, 14th. Does Lydia Coastal have a chance? She's three back. If she does, she needs to get something going right here. Good start. Yeah. Well, forget about a top 10 for Lydia. His designs on winning. This is for Birdie at the 14th. She is within two. Single handedly was taking down the U.S. Soheim Cup team. And here she is battling three of those players at the Meyer. <laughs> That's a good look, isn't it? Leona is going to finish ahead of the other contenders. Go for a birdie at 15. Oh, she ran out of steam. And, and Morgan, we talked about a little earlier, we've seen a lot of parts just left short today. Which just makes no sense in the sense that these players need to catch those leaders. The tier that she's going to have to climb up on. I mean, there's not an awful lot of green at the top of that once she gets to the top of it. 
Feels like a messed up and down, doesn't it, with Pepcho putting for Eagle? Well, it does, but after the last few chips like that came up short, not really surprised to see her give it a bit extra. Two back, four to go. Lydia Ko, three back with three to play, second at 16. It's a good side of the hole to be putting from there. This is for Birdie to get it to 16 under par. So if this goes in, which it does. Back over to 17, and Leona Maguire was not quite in the bunker there. I think maybe on the lip of the bunker. Well judged. Yeah. Off a pretty tremendous upslope. So she will have that to remain two back. Oh. Stay two back. And that yeah. was really well done. We deserved that little fist pump from the Irish woman. So much to play for in these last few holes. It can turn. Oh, it wobbled away wow. at the end. It looked good for so long. We had such a great angle. Ho, 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 Karen, that was close. Uh, Tom, that looked like that was in the whole way. Just maybe a little bit of a Poana wobble right at the very end. Whoa, whoa. Tried to sneak away at the very end. The same side that... Nelly's tried to move away, or did move away from the hole, so... And really put the pressure on Nelly. Nelly answered. Now a chance for Leona to post a number. Oh, she looks away. As good a putter as she is, you wouldn't put anything past her, would you? Well, this is huge for Leona. She's not been playing well, save for a good showing at the U.S. Women's Open. Team moved up a 17, so if we can get it to pitch in the fairway. And a short shot in. And she kind of got unlucky there. Yeah. She got on the down slope over that bunker. You know, maybe feeling a little extra pressure after notching her first win. Co needs to make this a 17. It didn't. She didn't hit it. She didn't give it enough pace. Is that like the third or fourth one today, Tom? Wow. That she's left short. We've just, yeah, we've seen uh, a, a staggering amount of parts left short. There's 13 up. And you could tell that from the crowd noise that Cupcho's ball was not close and getting further away. Wow. Did they? Could they tell that? Wow. I think she got a little bit unlucky there. I think that probably would have been about five or six feet past the hole. No! Get in there! Same thing. Yeah, just players reading way too much break. Come on now. She's one of the few to get it to the hole, at least. Yeah! She led by three early. Dropped a shot at four. Taking so some you'd really think. big practice swings, Karen. Yeah. And that was the danger that you, it was just going to bite too much with a, a more lofty club. That looked like that uh, little bit extra hit in it, Morgan. Yeah, a little bit of too much right hand. She knew yeah. it right away. Got too much right hand in it, it'll usually leads to a tug. Fans begin to scurry toward the 17th tee, and we have a two-way tie for the lead. Sounded a little clunky. That's just that firmer, firmest ground, I think, right there. Kind of what happened to Lydia, kicked off the downslope of that bunker. Right into play. I mean, she's just really pumped up. Hit off the downslope. There's a big downslope. Did she learn anything? And just hangs left. Not even sure with a fraction more pace it would have turned in. But Nelly now goes to the 72nd hole, one behind. So Cup Cho. Not to be, but this is going to be officially her 100th career top 10.
took nearly a good idea on Ellie's line. Not identical, but similar. Looks pretty good. Is it? Is it? No, oh, just going to hang out, go hang out there. Cucho will remain tied for the lead with Leona Maguire, who's already finished. Cucho has that par five, 18th to come, which is there for the taking. <coughs> It's just drawing left of the hole. That's where she would have probably thought she might be in two. Ooh. That just curls in. I don't know that, I don't know. I might say that I wanted to go first if I was away here. I might think you're right too. McGuire dodges one bullet. Let's keep playing. The defending champ, the reigning Chevron championship winner. But Leona just plays her own game. May have been the club that she was hitting on the practice team. And that would have been enough to have got to that bunker. It's on the center of the bunker there, and just off your right and helping. It. There's no problem for Nelly. Four. But the tree is. Yeah. Oh wow. She might have almost gotten away with that, but there's some. If it was if it was a grid strike, then she has to go left of it. Go. Shaking her head. Oh, just, <laughs> just. Wow, that could be the difference right there. It's an absolute beauty. And the pressure is on. There, Karen. No, she's landing it at that 145, like Jason was saying. Get in the hole. A little left. Yeah. That is. But it's very functional. Wow, well done. Wonderful shot. Started left, trying to move to the right. Has it got a hop? Uh -huh. What a shot. This could end what a shot. right now. Incredible. Say I'm a little bit shocked at that. After 6 p.m. to force an extra hole. They knock out Nelly. Birdie to get into the playoff. But a five. Hit it up in the air and get it up towards the front left of the yeah. green. Yeah. I think she wow. liked it. How about that shot from Leona McGuire? What a recovery. Hitting a fade with a fairway wood out of the rough. It is. Got underneath that one a little bit. This one's hanging out a bit to the right. Oh. Is it cling on? It's just going to drip off. And that's going to be very close as to. make these short putts and Jennifer's going to finish hers off. They're going to go to the par five fourth. Third playoff hole. Oh, no! a major I don't know how many putts you're going to have to win a tournament. I think marriage suits her. <laughs> 